The world is full of magic, energies, and so many possibilities. What if I told you, you can have anything you want? Yes, anything. Because with the universe, anything is possible. You are magic. Your thoughts are powerful. Your words are powerful. And what you believe is what you attract into your world. With the power of manifestation, you can create anything you want. Yes, anything you want. My shop, Jalissa's Manifestations, provides the tools to help you attract your desires, your wishes, your dreams. My candles are infused with crystals which hold energies and specific herbs to attract your manifestations. All you need is a wish and to believe. Energies are real and control your moods and what you attract. Sometimes we can feel depleted or in need of a boost of energy and that's what my spiritual baths are for. Cleansing, protecting, attracting love, abundance, and opportunities. The possibilities are endless. All you need is to believe. Believe in yourself. Believe in your dreams. Believe in the magic inside you. Just believe. hello my beautiful souls how are you guys doing i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are okay blessed it is your girl Jalissa, and i am coming to you guys with a pick a card reading of course per the usual today's pick a card reading is going to be a channeled message from your person okay so i am shuffling live i don't know what messages we're gonna get yet until we get there so i want you guys to take your time and choose your pile intuitively okay take your time don't rush there's no need to rush i'm not going anywhere i promise <laughs> okay um each pile is going to have a different message okay so close your eyes meditate for a second if needed open up your eyes and see which pile is calling your name then go to that pile okay timestamps are going to be listed down below in the description per the usual all right guys so pile one we have high five the high five sticker pal two we have the rainbow heart that says equality bless and pal three we have the pinky promise okay so these are the three stickers that i have for you guys today i don't want you to go off of the stickers i want you to go off of your intuition of course but i do put the stickers there to help you make your choice bless all right guys and before we get into this juicy reading i do want to quickly say thank you Thank you so much for being here with me today. Thank you so much for being part of my family, liking, sharing, subscribing, commenting on my channel. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate that. It goes such a long way for me. And I just, I, I can't express how much I love you guys because it's so much. It's like the ocean, okay? Now somebody tell me how deep is the ocean and I'll let you know how much my love is. <laughs> Bless. All right, guys. Um, also, thank you to everyone who has donated to the channel. Bless. I use the donations, guys, for the channel. It goes right back to the channel. I use it to buy new decks, um, to buy new charmies, um, crystals, stickers for us. All right. So thank you guys so much for those donations. You guys are so sweet. And I also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls that have purchased anything out of my manifestation shop. Bless. If you guys want my new year chakra candle, go ahead and check that out. It's the newest baby to my addition and it's hella powerful. It's really, really powerful. And you got to see it. It's a rainbow, of course, because we're doing the chakras. And um, it's it's just amazing and guys don't take it from me go and check out the reviews on my shop and see what people have to say about my items all right guys bless i love you guys so much and last but not least thank you spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels for being here with me today thank you thank you thank you okay so let's get it let's go all right guys pile one pile two pile three i will find you at your pile 
Timestamps are listed down below per the usual, like I said. So I'll find you at your pie, okay? Pile one, pile two, pile three. Let's get it. Let's go. Bless. Hi, pile one. Welcome to your reading, baby. All right, so let's get it. Let's go. Let's tap in. Bless. All right, pile one. So I'm going to do your angel number first, and then I'm going to go into your reading, okay? So spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for pile one. Thank you so much. Bless. All right, Paul one. You got two, six, one, six. Uh -huh. Your angel number, Paul one, is 2616. Go on to Google, put 2616 angel number meaning, and bam, there goes your message from Spirit, baby. Bless. Now, guys, if you can, please share your messages as I like to read them, and it's also beneficial for your fellow Paul ones as. Everybody gets a different message, okay? Bless. Thank you. All right, Paul One, you got this high five sticker. High five. And it's like art. Um, I'm definitely getting some good vibes here, all right? High fives are good vibes, all right? Usually you high five when you're congratulating someone or when you're saying, hey, what's up? All right, so this is positive vibes, Paul One. I definitely feel like this connection here... Um, is significant and I feel like your person has some very positive vibes when it comes to you okay so let's get a song out here with my music deck if you guys want your own music deck or my tarot deck definitely check out my shop they are available for limited time bless all right so let's get it let's go guys Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pa One. Thank you so much. Bless. Oof, that really like popped out there, huh? All right, let's go. We got Diddy. I need a girl. Mm. I, <laughs> I had a girl that would have died for me. Didn't appreciate her, so I made her cry for me. Every night she had tears in her eyes for me. Quarter K's, Shorty took the whole ride for me. First we were friends, then became lovers. You was more than my girl, we was like brothers. All night we would play fight under covers. Now you gone, can't love you like I really wanna. But every time I think about your pretty smile and how we used to drive the whole city wild, damn, I wish you would've had my child. A pretty little girl with a ditty smile. This shit is wild. All them days that I reminisce about the way I used to kiss them pretty lips. But as long as you happy, I'm going to tell you this. I love you, girl. And you're the one that I will always miss. Aww. There is strong nostalgic vibes here, Paul One. Okay? I definitely sense that some of you guys may be in separation or have lack of communication. I'm definitely getting hot and cold energies, but I'm sensing that your person is extremely nostalgic right now. They are regretting the way they treated you, all right? They're regretting what they didn't do for you and how you guys could have had a better future together had they treated you better. And they wish they would have appreciated you more than they did and that is coming out here babe and then we have Beyonce crazy in love I look and stare so deep in your eyes I touch on you more and more every time when you leave I'm begging you not to go call your name two three times in a row such a funny thing for me to try to explain how I'm feeling and my pride is the one to blame because I know I don't understand just how your love can do what no one else can all right, Paul One, your love is unique. Your love is one of a kind. And your love has your person feeling in ways that they've never felt before. And there is just this desire to communicate this with you. I feel like this is brewing up inside your person deep inside. And they wish to just like pop it out, like just get it off their chest. All right. So let's go into tarot. And we're going to get some oracle cards as well. And we're going to see what is your person's message for you today. What is the channeled message, Paul One? All right. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today 
for Paul One. Thank you so much. Spirit, what is Paul One's person's message to Paul One today? What would they like to say to Paul One at this time? Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel the message here today for Palm One. Thank you so much, bless. Guys, if you see some like white stuff around my fingers or nails or anything like that, just know I was making candles, okay? <laughs> Don't judge me. Um, I did clean my hands, but wax is a serious, serious material to deal with. Um, so sometimes it's just hard to take off. But yeah, just so you know, <laughs> just in case. All right, so we have here the five of coins, the king of cups in reverse, water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, the four of coins in reverse, the seven of cups in reverse. And the six of coins back of the deck we have the tower okay all right so let's get some more energies out here spare what is Paul one's person's message to Paul one today We have abundance. How beautiful is that image? I love it. We have release, the fall. It looks like spring and fall here. That could be significant for you guys. And oh my gosh, the rainbow community. How beautiful. All right, so let's get some messages out here. Spirit, what is Pop One's person's message to Pop One today? I don't react when people mention you. My life is not as together as it seems. I want you. So many things remind me of you. And I hide behind material things. Back of the deck, you don't know how hard it was to let you go. Yeah, I definitely got that vibe from the beginning with I need a girl. All right, let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pa One. Thank you so much. Bless. Hey, babe. I want you to know a few things. And I want you to know that a lot of what I've been showing you or demonstrating that I feel or that I'm going through at this time is all a facade. None of it is real. I'm only showing you the tip of the iceberg. There's so much I'm hiding underneath that mask as I am wearing a mask right now. I feel so lonely right now. I feel so cold. I feel so alone. It's dark. And I just wish I could wrap my arms around you, to be honest. I can't find a way to express this to you because I'm dealing with some ego issues. Sometimes I let pride get in the way of my own happiness. And this is something I'm learning about myself right now. I'm sorry that I manipulated you. And I'm sorry that I wasn't honest with you about my feelings and how deep I do feel for you. I feel like it is my karma that I'm out in the cold now. That I can't come inside and hug you and love you the way I actually want to. I feel seriously so alone. Right now, things are heavy. Things are too intense for me. Right now, I feel extremely vulnerable. I feel like I'm going through so much, not only with the fact that I don't have you to wrap my arms around, but also with my personal life. 
I'm having issues financially. I'm having issues with being strong. I feel weak. I feel like I I just can't hold on right now, honestly. I feel bad too because I know deep down inside I was wrong. I was wrong for the way I treated you and for what I didn't do for you. I should have done so much more. I'm living in regret and shame and it's not a good feeling but you're not the one to blame. I know this is my karma. You were so great to me. You gave me warmth, you gave me happiness. You are abundance. You are everything anybody could wish for. And I took advantage of that. And I wanna tell you right now that I'm sorry. This is tough love. And now I know what it means when people say, you don't know what you got until it's gone. That is true. I was so confused back then. I didn't know what I wanted. I wasn't sure about what I wanted to do with myself, where I wanted to be, what I should do. I had to make decisions. And instead of making a decision, I decided to stay in this confused energy. Not only did I confuse you, but I confused myself, to be honest. There's no one else to blame for what's going on here but me. And I want you to know that I've made my mind up. I know what I want now. And I want balance with you. I do. No matter how tough or how cool I come off to be, at the end of the day, I'm fragile. I'm sensitive. And I feel so weak without you in my life. I feel poor without you in my life. Like I don't have anything. And I wish to have balance with you. I want you, I know I want you, and I'm for sure of that. I wanna gift you, I wanna give back to you. I do. I wanna make things right. I know I mess things up by not being honest with you and not being straightforward. By painting a picture that wasn't really there. And for that, I am sorry. I am releasing these patterns. I'm releasing these low vibrational ways. I know it's time for change. In order for me to be happy, I have to change. I can't be happy in this energy. I know it hasn't gotten me happiness so far. So I know it's me that has to change in order to have happiness, especially with you. I want to get together with you. I want my rainbow with you. Rainbows only come after a storm. We went through a storm, babe. I know we did. It got cold. It got wet. It got real dark. And I felt that. And I'm sorry for that. But I just pray and hope that we can move forward from that and embrace this rainbow. It's not over. I want you to know that. I hide behind my material things, cars, status, clothes, clout. I hide behind those things so that I come off as stable, so that I come off as I'm all good. It's all good. But in a reality, it's not. It's all a facade. It's all fake, it's all an act, so that nobody knows how much I am truly suffering within me. I care about what people have to say. And I think that's something I have to work on. But I truly do. And I just don't want people to say that I'm weak and vulnerable and that I'm not good enough. When people mention you, I act unfazed. I act as if I'm unbothered. But like I said, it's a front, it's an act, it's a mask, it's what I do so that people know that I'm not weak. But in all reality, I'm very weak because I'm scared of what people think about me and I'm scared of what you think of me. Of me. So I act as if I'm all good, but in reality, I'm not. 
Just know that my life isn't all together as it seems. Like I said, I'm having some sort of financial issues right now. And this is bringing me to my knees. I really feel like I'm hitting rock bottom. And all I could think about is how much I want you. So many things remind me of you. And you don't know how hard it was for me to actually walk away. I didn't want to walk away. I let pride take over me. And I need to definitely apologize to you for that. Because you did not deserve that. You don't deserve any of this, to be honest. You deserve nothing but the best. But I'm being honest at this time. And this is my message to you. Whoa. Okay, pa one. Um Your person, baby, is I don't know who they are in society, okay? For some of you guys they may have clout, you know, they may be popular, maybe have fame or um wow my fish just went crazy when I said that, okay. Bless. Alright, so Koi agrees with me <laughs> um but i do get that your person um they definitely feel like they're somebody special which of course they should feel everybody should feel special right um but for some reason they're very scared about what people think about them all right there is this fear of being judged by society all right and this has a lot to do with the way your person operates and how they hide their emotions, all right? So when they were younger, they may have gone through some bullying or some sort of childhood trauma that made them create some sort of facade, a personality, a character, um, a mask that makes them feel safe for self. And so they use this character, this mask, this facade in all areas of their life, work, love friendships family you know like when you go to work you put on a face that you don't really have outside right you're professional you're on the books you know you're you're that person at work and then when you get out of work you're a whole nother person and it's kind of like that type of energy like your person i feel like they're always at work because they're always putting up a front they're always putting up some sort of facade um in some way here and it's catching up with them and that's what your person is realizing like everything is catching up and it hurts them because that character, that facade, that mask is kind of preventing their happiness. Until they open up and keep it real with self and you, they're going to be in this really sad energy, sad space. Um, Because what I see is that your person is super duper nostalgic. They miss you and they want you so much, but they're letting their pride and their ego get the best of them. Okay. So, you know what we're going to do? We're going to go into your person, all right? So, we're going to go into your person, and we're going to do this in the extended, okay? Just so you know. And I'm going to tap in, and I'm going to find out more about your person, more about what's to be expected from your person, and what changes are happening within your person that are going to benefit you, all right, so what is it about your person that's going to change, that's going to help your relationship, or what is it they're, they're intending to do, if, if they're going to do anything, right? So we're going to look into that in the extended. I'm going to play Diddy, I Need a Girl, as I shuffle and leave the cards out, and I'm also going to get a lot of messages from your person as well, more messages to see what they would like to say to you at this time. Aside from that, I'm going to get a lot of advice, all right? So if you guys feel like you need some advice today, that is where you want to go. Because I'm going to pull a whole lot of advice for you, Pal One. Okay? Bless. And the link for that is going to be down below in the description. Okay? So after the reading, if you want to join me, you are more than welcome to. Now we're going to do story time. Okay? Okay. Now, guys, I am going to use this globe to get the answer for your question today. So if you guys have a question, we're going to see what answer we get with my globe today. And I do want you guys to give me your opinion. Do you prefer this globe or the pendulum? What is it that you guys prefer? Because I'm going to go with y'all opinions. Y'all my family members, all right? This is our home. So it's not all about me. I want to know what you guys like too, okay? 
So um, let's get it, let's go. This gets really loud, so if you're sensitive to noise, you may want to lower the volume. Ready, set, go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, these can be in the community and secure today for coming on. So whatever it's coming for coming on. Okay. I'm hearing a Bad Bunny song. Um, se murió. I, I don't know the name I was trying to get it like that's what I was doing just now I was trying to get the name of the song honestly but I don't um I couldn't get it but basically the piece that I'm hearing and I'm channeling right now is it's um lo, lo tuyo y lo mio se murió something something tu no me amas or something like that it's like um well me and you had died and now you don't love me something like that is what i'm hearing it's a bad bunny song so for all my latinos or anybody that is into bad bunny if you know the song let me know down below so everybody could go ahead and connect to that love bad bunny all right so let's go we're gonna put this to the side we're gonna do story time with my story dice first okay okay if you guys want story dice that is also available on my shop your person definitely wants to reach out to you all right they want to hit some sort of home run all right so they want to go all the way with you right now they're kind of in between worlds where they're like yes and no i don't know which way i'm gonna go they're like um procrastinating really like thinking thinking but they are going to reach out and they're going to like kind of holler like they're going to reach out um very loudly i don't know how they're going to do that loudly maybe they're going to see you in the street or something i don't know um but they i see that your person's thinking about a home so they may be thinking about your home or their home um there's a lot about your person just really kind of letting things dry out letting things kind of air out at the moment and um then wanting to approach you all right because i see that your person wants to go out to party with you right now um your person is studying or you know if they're in school they're definitely studying um but overall i see that they're looking into something new they're trying to find out some information and they're also concerned about money all right i see your person like counting their money a little bit curious about how much they got how much they need all right so there's money matters in your person's world okay all right and that was story time with Jalissa. now let's go into your charms okay here we go now i do need a second just to organize the charmies and then we're gonna go into it so give me a second baby okay thank you bless okay hello there how you guys doing i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are okay if you guys are new to my channel welcome welcome to the family so happy to have you here all right um if you are enjoying yourself and want to see more readings like so definitely consider staying subscribing and hitting that bell button bless not only will you get juicy readings throughout the week but you will also be part of my weekly raffle which is my way of saying thank you to all my family members my subscribers all right so what i do is that i gift a magical box out once a week to one special random subscriber and commenting does help your chances on winning guys so let me tell you that bless all right and um yeah so all you have to do is subscribe and hit that bell button and that's me baby oprah <laughs> um winners are always announced on the community board monday tuesday or wednesday all right so always look out for your name hi my ogs how you guys doing i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are blessed all right so let's go into this um what i'm seeing here part one is that the wheel is definitely moving for you guys meaning that tables are about to turn in a big way what exactly does that mean that means luck is on your side mm -hmm. now when it comes to your person right now your person's energies is all over the place okay kind of all over the place i'm getting a playboy playgirl type of energy someone that's like unstable someone that is kind of just playing the field all right 
with no direction in life right now uh, i see that there is a lot of depression associated to your person all right and i am seeing um you and another person all right so there may be some sort of obstacle here an ex or friends or family member or something like that because i'm getting you and another person I'm getting um, fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I'm getting air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, but I am seeing that you and your person match perfectly and that there's some sort of outsider situation that may be interfering, okay? But there's a lot, like I said, there's a lot of sad energies connected to your person. They're not in a really good space. A couple of days to weeks from now, expect some sort of offer from your person, all right? So I see your person coming towards you with some sort of offer um i see them wanting to offer you something in a couple of days to weeks okay bless and i'm also seeing an ending here so there's some ending an ending of a cycle you guys could be in separation or you guys could have um kind of cut ties for a second is what i'm getting here um or they're cutting ties with someone else but that's what i'm picking up here all right now as far as initials go first middle last this could be yours or theirs we have m H K V N L O U M A K U P Q T O Q T L A Y T W F C O F J. All right, let's go into the charmies now. All right, so I am getting a lot about sweets. All right, so somebody here may have like a sweet tooth. Um, mm -hmm. Some sort of sweet tooth, all right? I'm getting a lot like muffins, chocolates. I'm also seeing like um, crepe, crepes, creepy crepes, however you say it, all right? Um, yeah, popcorn, all sorts of treats, all right? So someone, cookies. There's like a sweet tooth here. Someone may like sweets or maybe bakes, culinary, okay? I have grape juice as well. Someone may be really into grape juice. Spirit is saying to drink water, all right? Pa one, there's a need for you to drink some more water than you usually do. And wish fulfillments are on the way, okay? So know that your wishes are coming true. I keep getting this house, all right? So there's a house that's being brought up. This could be your home or their home. Maybe they're thinking about coming to your home or buying a home or someone's worried about a home, but I keep seeing a home and I'm getting a snitch. All right. So somebody may have snitched or there's some sort of snitch. Somebody out here telling lies. Um, mm -hmm. I have basketball. All right. So someone may like to watch or play basketball. Spirit is showing me that everything is happening in divine timing, all right? So when it's supposed to happen, it will happen. And Spirit wants you to know what's for you will not pass you, all right? Meaning that if this is your person, this is your your soulmate, your twin flame, your lover, then this is your person and it will not pass you if it's really yours, right? And I see an audience here, all right? So I'm seeing people watching, a lot of people watching you, Paul One. Um, this could be friends, relatives, this could be an audience, um, but I see a lot of people watching you. And I'm getting a lot about sports, soccer, basketball, even mechanics, all right? Fixing things, um, a lot of chef vibes as well. I see that you will be cutting cords with something, okay, in the near future. This means something that you need to let go of. I see you cutting it, all right? There is deep feelings here, and you guys are, are definitely protected. You have a pure light, pal one. Um, tap into that light. You are a unicorn. You're not meant to be tied down. You're meant to fly free. You are a free spirit. You are a divine being having a human experience, and spirit wants you to tap into that beautiful light, okay? Doors will be opening up for you, Paul One, and I see some money coming in, okay? And as far as signs go, we have Sagittarius. Like I said, we got Fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We got Air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and more Fire, okay? <laughs> and Leo, Leo coming out strong, okay? Bless. Now, let's go into this globe all right my question globe so think of a question guys okay ready set go spirit what is the answer for power one <laughs> all right let's see what we got
we got relationship difficulty all right your answer is relationship difficulty however that associates to your question there's some sort of spiritual obstacle all right so the answer may be no and to change your mindset okay bless now guys i'm gonna go off to the extended and go deeper into your reading i'm gonna go deeper into your person and see what's to be expected from your person and how they're doing what's coming what's going with your person we're gonna get all the four one one on them and you and we're gonna get more messages from your person and advice and guidance from the universe a whole lot of advice all right guys so if you want to join me the link is going to be down below in the description i hope to see you there give me a second if so thank you so much bless pa one if this is where we're parting ways i just want to say i love you thank you so much for being here with me today i totally appreciate your presence and your love and your positivity if you enjoyed this reading today if it resonated with you please give it a thumbs up as that helps my channel it helps the family it helps me and it also lets me know that you want to see more readings like so all right guys so give it a thumbs up thank you so much <laughs> for my new sisters and brothers hi how you doing babe welcome to the fam welcome to the fam make sure that after you subscribe you hit that bell button because it's really important okay Mwah. And my OGs, you already know what time it is. I love you guys so much. I'm sending you love, light, and everything nice. Mwah. Deuces. Bless. Hey, Pal2. Welcome to your reading, baby. Bless. Thank you so much for being here today. All right, so let's get it. Let's go. Bless. All right, Pal2, let's get your angel number out here before we start your reading. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pal2. Thank you so much. Bless. Spirit, what is the angel number for Pal2? Thank you. All right, Pal2, let's get your angel number out here. Guys, if you see any white stuff around my hands or nails, just know I was making candles earlier <laughs> and it is very hard to take wax off. All right. So don't judge me. Okay, bless. <laughs> Pal 2, your angel number is 5453. Go on to Google or your search engine and put 5453 angel number meaning and bam, there goes your message from spirit. Bless. All right, guys, if you can, definitely share your messages as it does help your fellow Pal 2 viewers. And also, I like to read them. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. All right, Pal 2, you guys, you guys chose this beautiful sticker equality all right with the rainbow some of you guys may be same sex bless um but it doesn't necessarily have to just mean that all right this means happiness rainbows rainbows are happiness all right equality equal so Paul to definitely get that your person wants to be equal with you all right they want to have that equality with you in this love all right and rainbows come after storms all right so I definitely sense that there is a rainbow coming and your person desires to be equal to have balance to see eye to eye all right bless now let's get a song out here guys mm -hmm. with my music deck all right so we're gonna get a song out here and then we're gonna go into the message for you Patu. spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through and help me channel this message here today for Patu. thank you so much bless Guys, if you want your own music deck or my tarot deck, definitely check out my shop listed down below and you could get that today. It is limited. Um, it is for a limited time now. So first come, first serve. Okay, bless. All right, Spirit. What is the vibe for Pao Tu, Pao Tu and their person right now? What is the energy? We have Mariah Carey, we belong together. I didn't mean it when I said I didn't love you, so... I should I should have held on tight. I should have never let you go. I didn't know nothing. I was stupid. I was foolish. I was lying to myself. Okay. So this sounds like a confession if you ask me. I do feel like your person is saying that they feel foolish and stupid that they didn't hold on tighter to you and they shouldn't have not let you go because they feel like you guys belong together. And then we also have Hood Celebrity Walking Trophy. I can take you to LA. We go shopping for the day. I'm spending it all on you, girl. Spending it all on you. Anyway. Dance hall vibes. Close the all of the night. 
my crib close by we go we could like hood girl tell me it's a go for tonight baby girl you got the glow in the the lights all right so you're walking trophy mm -mm. yeah so your person definitely sees you pal too as a walking trophy all right you are the glow in the lights all right you are the light baby you are special and your person definitely feels like you guys belong together and they're they're having some sort of regrets here is what i'm getting all right so let's get it let's go spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels Please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pal 2. Thank you so much, Spirit. Bless. Spirit, what would Pal 2's person like to say to Pal 2 at this time? What is Pal 2's person's message to Pal 2 at this time? All right, let's get it. Let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels. Thank you so much. We have the Eight of Cups in reverse. We have Strength, that Leo energy, oh hi. We have the King of Swords in reverse. Here we do energy, we don't do sex by the way. Bless, 444, just saw that. Um, <coughs> excuse me. This is Air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have Death in reverse. Okay. And we have the star in reverse. Ooh, tough, tough energies. Okay, back of the deck, we have the hangman in reverse. All right. One second. Let's get some more cards out here. All right. Spirit, talk to me. Pautu's person, message to Pautu. We have solitude. We have potential. We have abundance. Beautiful. And we have diligence at the back of the deck. All right. Let's get some messages out here. All right, Spirit, what's the message for Patsu? What's this person's message to Patsu? We will be together again, matching your song. We belong together. I hide behind material things. I don't react when people mention you. And you speak to me through music. All right, so let's get it. Let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for part two. Thank you so much. Bless. Okay. Hey, babe. I want you to know that I am coming back to you. I apologize for how things may have went between me and you, but I've had a lot of time in solitude to think about what happened between me and you, and I'm coming back. I'm sorry I wasn't able to fulfill you emotionally in the past. I wanna change that in my return. I'm much stronger now than I was before. I needed some time alone to think about where I wanted to be, what I wanted to do, and about us. And I'm much stronger now. I am, and I wanna do what I need to do to get this going. At this moment, I'm wearing a mask. I'm not showing you entirely what I think or feel as I'm trying to keep my cards hidden. I don't wanna show you everything I want to show you little by little, but this has to do with my emotions as I am in a very dark place right now. I feel like nothing's really moving for me. Everything has just stand still ever since us, ever since 
I walked away ever since things kind of fell apart between us things have been stagnant and I've been feeling very much alone I'm part to blame for this I feel like I have destroyed the hope between us and sometimes I just feel stuck and that's why I don't really reveal everything I think and feel because I don't want you to see how insecure I am I don't want you to know how hurt I am it will make me seem vulnerable and I want to be strong for you I want you to see me as a strong individual that could hold it down and that could do right by your side at this moment I'm really stressed and I feel a bit depressed I'm down, I'm out, I'm lonely. I'm in a really dark place, like I said. And I know I'm the one to blame. I know. Sometimes I may play that victim card and act as if I'm not the one to blame. But no matter who, tra who was a traitor in our situation, I am the one to blame. Because I wasn't transparent with you and I wasn't honest with you. And this leaves me alone, feeling stuck. It's such a, it's such a bad feeling, babe. Let me tell you, I'm watching you from above. I'm watching you from afar. I wanna keep an eye on you. I wanna see what's going on. I'm trying to be strong. I'm trying to do it for us. I promise, despite the way I'm feeling, despite the way I see things going, I'm trying to hold on and I'm trying to be positive and move forward because I know we have potential. I know this relationship has potential. I want to be equal with you. I want to see eye to eye with you. With you, I feel like my life is full of abundance. It's full of happiness. It's full of joy. It makes me feel warm inside just thinking about us and where we can be in life. Had I only been honest with you had I not walked away from you. And I regret that. I regret not holding on tight to you. I should have never let you go. I was just so stupid and foolish and letting my pride and ego get in the way. I was lying to myself, honestly. And I'm hiding all of this from you right now. I know how to wear a mask and I know how to wear it well. If having a poker face would be a profession, I would be really good at that. I would have a very great career because I know how to hide my feelings extremely well. But I want you to know that I have high hopes of us being back together and we will be together again. I'm confident in that because I'm going to do what I have to do to get us back there. I hide behind material things, status, cars, clothes house, all that stuff, you know, that show that you're doing good in life or you're stable. Yeah, right. That's all a facade. Don't worry about the looks. Don't worry about the outside, the 3D stuff. It's a facade. I'm just hiding behind it so that I look like I'm okay. But in all reality, I'm not. I'm not okay. I'm upset with myself. I'm angry with myself that I let us get to this place. When people mention your name or mention us, I act as if it, like if I'm not phased, like if I'm okay, but we both know I'm not. I just put up a facade like I usually do. Like I said, I wear a mask very well. Sometimes I trick myself in believing I'm okay when deep down inside I know I'm not because I'm not, I could feel it. I wouldn't feel so sleepy and tired and down and out if I was good. I hear you through music. The songs I listen to connect back to us, connect back to our relationship, and connect back to what you would say to me. The messages that I hear in the music, I feel like it's you sending those messages to me. Are you communicating with me telepathically? I feel so connected. I do, and I wonder sometimes, am I crazy, or is this magic? Anyway, I want you to know that I'm coming back to you. This time, I'm coming strong. 
and I'm going to make changes because I want a future with you. I do. Huh, okay. Pato. So, yes, your person is coming back towards you, all right? Whether you walked away or they walked away, just know that they're coming towards you. Uh -huh. And they're coming in strong. They are. They are going to come in strong. But they're not going to show you right away what they're feeling or what they're thinking. Because a lot of what they're feeling and thinking are very low vibrational thoughts and feelings. And they don't want to look vulnerable in front of you. So they're going to try to hide the fact that they're low-key depressed and they're in this um, rock-bottom energy, okay? So just expect your person to come off as if they're okay and everything was all right and how you been, how you doing, oh, I've been good, you know? But in all reality, they've been suffering. They've been really going through it. And um, they're going to show you that little by little, all right? They're not going to open up right away. It's going to take your person some time, but they will open up eventually, just little by little. Okay, babe? Bless. Now, guys, we are going to go off to the charmies. This is my globe. All right, guys, I want your opinion. We usually use the pendulum, but we're using my globe today for the question, if you have a question. Okay, we're going to spin this after the Charmies. So if you have a question, think about it now. We'll spin this after the Charmies. Okay? Bless. I want you guys to know that um, this doesn't end here. Okay? We are going to do an extended. And in the extended, I'm going to go into your person. Right? And I'm going to tell you, not only am I going to channel you another message from your person, but I am also going to tell you what's really going on deep down inside besides what we got here. But we're going to get more details. We're going to go deeper in the extended. All right. And I'm going to go very deep into your person's emotions and intentions with you. All right. So if you want to know about that and you want to hear some more messages from your person and advice and guidance from the universe, join me. I'm going to give you a lot of advice and guidance. OK, so it's worth your while. Bless. And the link for that is going to be down below in the description. I hope to see you there, guys. All right. So until then, let's do the charmies, okay? <laughs> if you guys are sensitive to noise, this is when you want to lower the volume as this gets really loud. And I just saw 555, five, five, by the way, okay? Ready, set, go. Your person is very passionate about you, Pauzo, and um, they're thinking about intercourse, okay? Just had to throw that out there. <laughs> they're thinking about intimate moments with you. All right, um, let's get some initials. Okay, so we're going to do that in a second. First, we're going to do story time with my story dice. If anybody wants dice, they are available on my shop. All right, let's go. So, what this person I to say to at this time? All right, so your person wants to, your person wants you to know that they are going to be reaching out. It is difficult for your person to reach out for whatever reason. I guess they don't like to initiate conversation, but it's going to be difficult. But I see them reaching out and your person is actually at the fork of the road right now where they're trying to figure out what they want to do with their life. OK, they're thinking about creative ways they could make money and they want to give you a gift. Now, they may tell you that they were sick all right, or that they're feeling sick. OK, and they're going to be really happy to speak to you. They're also going to talk to you about music, maybe the songs that they hear that relate to you. Maybe they're going to dedicate a song to you, but they're going to want to link up with you and hang out. So expect an invitation. Bless. Okay. And this was Charmy Times with Jalissa. Bless. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's zoom in. All right, so I do need to organize the charms. So if you guys could give me a second, I appreciate that. Bless. Hello there. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are good. I hope you guys are blessed. Bless, bless, bless. If you are new to my family, welcome. Welcome to the family. So happy to have you here today. All right. If you like it here so far, definitely stay. Why go? 
pull the chair out and sit down and become part of this family all right all you have to do is subscribe and hit that bell button that's pretty much it it's that simple all right not only will you get good reads throughout the week but you'll be part of a beautiful welcoming community here on my channel bless and i am baby oprah all right i'm gifting somebody on the weekly a thank you box in this thank you box i am giving a bunch of spiritual goodies i'm giving away my tarot deck this week along with one of my candles i'm going to choose a candle intuitively for the winner and a crystal okay so if you want that gotta be part of family okay part of family subscribe and hit that bell button winners are always announced on the community board monday tuesday or wednesday so always look out for your name bless hi my ogs how you guys doing oh and by the way commenting helps your chances on winning that is a clue <laughs> for you <laughs> all right so let's go here guys um mm -hmm. i see your person very focused focused on money focused on working right now all right they're showing me that um very very focused on building some sort of um empire foundation all right as far as initials go first middle last initial this could be yours or theirs i have w v s s L O S F Q H D L F Z E Q W L P Y J C X T J R Q A X there's a lot of questions and answers, all right? Your person has a lot of questions. You may want a lot of answers, all right? I'm getting here babies, okay? So something about a baby, baby girl possibly. Um, children could be a factor in your connection. I'm also getting that someone likes to get um, intoxicated, maybe drunk or high. We're getting here some prune juice, um, pear juice, all right? Someone may really like that. And I see that your person is going to crown you, all right? Crown you queen, king, however it goes, all right? So you will be getting that crown. And Spirit is saying to drink more water. Mm-hmm. Drink more water. There's a lot of layers to this situation, Pautu, okay? Just because um, things may have not gone the way you guys expected in the connection, Spirit is showing me that there is a lot of layers here. It's deeper than it seems. And I see that your person is moving very, very slow. But remember, the rabbit did did not win the race. The turtle did, right? The rabbit got real confident, thought that, oh, I got skill, I got speed. There's no way this turtle is winning and took a nap and slept on the competition. And guess what? Who won the competition? Um, the turtle did, right? So basically what I'm getting is like, don't rush things all right take it easy and slow just continue pushing forward consistency is key to success all right i see a lot of money coming your way mm, bless and i see messages from your person coming in all right they're hopeful when it comes to this connection and i'm getting family forever all right so they there may be some family ties here and i'm getting here i love you from i love you to the moon and back and the wheel is turning on your connection meaning luck is on your side all right which is great you have a lot of angels around you i'm getting basketball here so someone may like to watch basketball or play basketball and we got roses all right so you guys are unfolding as we speak there is an ascension happening um layers are opening up and things are about to get way more beautiful and luck is definitely on your side babe just so you know and I'm getting cola, Coca-Cola. Somebody may like that. Like I said, you guys are ascending, okay? You guys are blossoming. So there is growth happening here with you, Pautu. Beautiful, blessed. And I see a lot of money coming your way. So expect money. All right, life is a gift and spirit wants you to know that. And we have Oreos here, all right? So um, I'm getting... um. I'm getting a mix all right so somebody may be mixed here um maybe mixed in culture um mixed i'm getting mixed so it could be mixed spanish white black spanish white however it goes um i'm getting a mix somebody may be mixed okay and money a lot of money okay so money is a factor we have oklahoma here the year 2008 
and we have here North Carolina, okay, Blue Ridge, the year 2015, bless. And you're in a cycle, so you're going around and around in circles, it feels like, in this connection. But there is a blessing towards the end of this cycle. Always remember that there is love here between you and your person. And I do feel like... Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Someone must really like Oreos and milk. All right, milk with Oreos or something like that. <laughs> That's what I'm seeing. All right, now as far as signs go, we have Sagittarius, we have Gemini, we have Aquarius, and we have Sagittarius again. All right, so this could be your sign, their sign, or within your charts. Okay, that's very important. Now let's go into my globe. All right, guys, so think of your question, what you would like to ask today, and let's see what we get. Spirit, what is the answer for Pao Tzu? I want to swear it really good. Okay, let's go. What's your answer? Good idea. All right. Um, Spirit is saying that's a good idea. Yes. Favorable outcome. And ask someone close to you, by the way, as well. All right. So that's good vibes. Good idea. I don't know if you can see it with the sp with the glitter, but it says good idea. Yes. Ask someone close and favorable outcome. Bless. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. <laughs> I'm now going to go off to the extended where I'm going to go deeper into this connection. So if you want to know more, join me. The link is going to be down below in the description, and I hope to see you there. I'm going to go into your person. It's going to be an extended channel message, so I'm going to give you another message from your person, and I'm also going to go into their feelings, their intentions, and I'm going to speak to you about that. I'm going to get more messages from your person and advice and guidance from the universe. So we're going to go in. If you want to join me, link is down below. I hope to see you there. If so, give me a second. Pal 2, if this is where we're parting ways, I just want to say I love you. Thank you so much for being here today, guys. Bless. I hope you enjoyed today's reading. I hope it brought you warmth and comfort. Give me a thumbs up if that's the case. All right, if it resonated with you, give me a thumbs up. That really helps the channel and helps me as well to know that you want to see more videos like so. All right, bless. And for my new sisters and brothers, welcome to the family. How you doing? Bless. Um, guys, make sure that after you subscribe, you hit that bell button. It's so important. Okay, guys, remember. And my OGs, you already know what time it is. I love you guys so much. I'm sending you love, light, and everything nice. Mwah. Deuces. Bless. Hello, pal three. Welcome to your reading. Bless. Thank you so much for being here with me today. All right, so let's get it. Let's go. Bless. All right, so let's get your angel number out here first, and then we're going to go into your reading. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for my beautiful Patris. Bless. Spirit, what is Patris' angel number? All right, Patris, let's get it, let's go. All right, we got 5116, okay? Patris, your angel number is 51. 16 go on to google or your search engine put 5116 angel number meaning and bam there goes your message from spirit if you can definitely share your message as i love to read them and also it's beneficial for your fellow pal threes bless all right so let's get it let's go all right pal three you chose this cute sticker okay pinky promise all right so there was some sort of promise here in your connection that your person is thinking about and wants to talk to you about it all right something they may have promised you their intention or they were gonna do or something something about a promise all right so there's heavy heavy thoughts on a promise they owe you all right spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guides angels Please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pal 3. Pal 3, we're going to pick a song for you. We're going to see what the energy is. If you guys want your own song deck, it is available on my shop now for a limited time. The link is down below. Bless. So is my tarot deck that I designed myself. Okay. 
All right, let's get it. Let's go. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for pal three plus. All right, spirit, what is the energy between pal three and their person today? We have destiny, childs, bills, bills, bills. At first, we started off real cool, taking me places I ain't never been. But now you're getting comfortable, ain't doing those things you did no more. You're slowly making me pay for things your money should be handling. And now you ask me to use my car, car, drive it all day and don't fill up the tank. And you have the audacity to even come and step to me and ask to hold some money from me until you get your check next week. Bills, bills, bills. All right, so... Ooh, heavy energies, pal three. <laughs> okay. Um, so I sense that in the beginning between you and your person, things were sweet. Um, as most things are for most people, most relationships. And then little by little, your person got way too comfortable. All right. Maybe not coming up with dates anymore, asking for favors, slowly making you pay for things. Okay. And then we have here 50 cent best friend. If I was your best friend, I want you around all the time. I want you around me all the time. Can I be your best friend? If you promise you'll be mine, girl, promise you'll be mine. Please say he's just a friend. Uh-huh. Now, girl, let's not pretend. Come on. Either he is or he ain't your man. Ha-ha. Uh -huh. Please say he's just a friend. If I was your best friend, I want you around all the time. I want you around all the time. Can I be your best friend? If you promise you'll be mine, girl, promise you'll be mine. Please say he's just a friend. Now, girl, let's not pretend. Come on. Either he is or he ain't your man. Haha. -ha. Please say he's just a friend. If I was your best friend. All right. So I feel like there is like, for some of you guys, um, kind of like friends with benefits type of energy. All right. Um, also picking up someone that is like kind of concerned about a third party all right outside interferences and just not living up to the expectation like you promised you had intentions i'm getting you sold me a dream all right you didn't really fulfill what you said you were gonna do for me type of energy all right so let's get it let's go let's see what their message to you is today all right Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pal 3. Bless. Spirit, what is Pal 3's person's message to Pal 3 at this time? What would Pal 3's person like to say to Pal 3 today? What would they like to say? Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, Please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pal 3. Bless. Thank you so much. What is Pal 3's person's message to Pal 3 at this time? We have the Knight of Wands in reverse. All right. That's some fire energy. We have the Hierophant. Okay. We have the Nine of Swords in reverse. We have the Knight of Cups in reverse. We have the Ace of Coins in reverse. And we have the Seven of Swords upright. Uh -huh. So let's get more. Let's get more out here so we get a bigger message. We have voyage. Okay. We have abundance. And we have transformation. Wow, that's a beautiful flower. I love that. I was so tattooed that flower. I mean, well, both the flower and butterfly. That is beautiful. All right, let's get more. What would Pal 3's person like to say to Pal 3 at this time? I regret lying to you. I look for you everywhere. I want you.
it's time for me to heal now. And you came closer than anyone. All right, let's get it. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Pal 3. Thank you so much. Bless. Hey, babe. I want you to know that right now I'm in a really low energy. I'm all over the place. I'm a mess. I am. It's sad to say, but it's the truth. I'm in a chaotic energy. I'm up, down, and around. I don't know where I want to be. I don't know what I want to do. I'm all over the place. I'm jealous. I'm angry. I'm excited. I'm sexually frustrated. I'm confused. I don't know what to do. I'm sorry that I had some unrealistic expectation with you. I thought that I could have my cake and eat it too. I was wrong, really wrong. I'm sorry that I came into your life with this energy and brought you so much chaos and drama. You're a great person and I know you want something real. I know you want something traditional. I know you want order. But at this time, I'm not in the right energy to give you that. I would be lying if I told you I was, because I'm not. Right now, I'm in my ego and pride. I'm acting very immature because I have a lot of growing up to do, to be honest. I've been having issues sleeping at night stressing family, stressing money, stressing you, stressing me, stressing life. And I'm trying to get over that. I'm trying to rest. I'm trying to heal. But it's as if I'm battling myself because I can't. My energy is just all over the place. I'm not centered. I'm not stable. And because of that, it's so difficult for me to rest. And it's so difficult for me to clear my mind of the clutter the mess, the thoughts, the drama, the chaos. I'm greedy, baby. I am. And right now, I'm just thinking about myself. I'm being selfish. I'm having issues with money. I'm in debt. I'm stressing that a lot. I'm stressing money a lot right now. I feel like I need to make ends meet I don't know what to do I don't know where I'm going I'm just like a really hot mess and it sucks it really does it sucks I'm sorry I lied to you I'm sorry I wasn't honest with you I wore a mask with you and I wore it very well and that's not something I'm proud of I did it because I was operating through my ego my pride I wanted my cake and I wanted to eat it too. I have a lot of growing up to do. I'm going to be very honest. I regret lying to you. I regret not telling you the truth. I regret keeping things from you and being so selfish. You were such a gift, a gift from the gods. You were so great to me. You gave me everything I wanted. You brought so much to the table. You made me feel happy. You made me feel warm inside. I owe you so much. But right now, personally, I'm going through a lot. I am transforming. I am changing. I'm fighting my shadows. I'm fighting my old ways because I want to heal. I don't want to be in this energy. I don't want to manipulate. I don't want to lie. I don't want to cheat. I don't want to steal. I don't want to be this person anymore. I want to be relaxed. I want to rest. I want to finally close my eyes and be at peace and just relax instead of stress. I look for you everywhere. I try to find out things about you. I'm curious. I'm nostalgic. I'm thinking about you a lot. 
because I want you. But right now, it is time for me to heal. It is. I'm on a journey, baby. And I'm growing. I'm trying to get out of this immature phase. And in order to do that, I need to go on this path alone. I need to heal before I come for you. I am selfish, so you know, I will try to come towards you while healing, but just know I'm not ready. I'm not ready at this moment. I need to transform. I need to release my past person and embrace a new version of me, a more developed, grown, stable version of me. Because this old person that I'm seeing in the mirror, it ain't it. It ain't it. It's not doing anybody any good. Not you or me. And it's time for change. If I want happiness, if I want joy, if I want you, I know I need to change. And that's what I'm working on. I want you to know that you came close, closest to my heart closer than anybody has ever come to my heart and you mean a lot to me it's just that I'm selfish and immature and I don't want to hurt you and because of that I am taking time to heal I am recognizing my flaws my shadows and I promise you that I am changing and when I'm a better person, I will show you what I'm about. I know I can do better. I know I can be better. Please give me time to show you. Okay, babes. Oof. This was deep. Very, very deep, how three, I must say. Okay. Your person is going through a lot. All right, a lot of karma. Right now, your person is like literally all over the place. Mess.com, okay? Your person has some sort of unrealistic expectation with you. I'm getting hot and cold as fast as they came. They, they ran as fast as they came, you know? Like, I'm just getting an in and out, passionate, like fiery, and then cold energy, kind of confusing, okay? And it's because of their energy. They're all over the place. And they're operating from a very selfish energy where they're just thinking about greed and pleasure. And there's a lot of healing that your person is about to do that's going to help them go through a transformation, which is great. They want you. And that's a fact. And they're going to come for you. Know that for sure. If they haven't already. Um, but they have to go through this transition in order to do better by you. Okay, because right now they wouldn't do good by anybody, honestly, because they're in this me, 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 me type of energy. Okay, and they have to release that in order to be there for you. All right, so let's go into the charms, guys. Let's see what else we get. Now, I want you to know that I am going to do an extended. Okay, in the extended, I am going to channel another message from your person. But it's going to be way deeper as I'm going to get more cards. So we're going to see what else your person has to say to you today. And we're going to get messages, a lot more messages from your person and see what else they want to say to you, Padre. Okay, so if you want to join me for that, the link is going to be down below. Aside from that, I am going to pull a lot of advice for you. And this is general advice for you, Padre. So it's going to be juicy. It's going to be fun. And it's going to be exciting. I'm going to play Bills, Bills, Bills by Destiny's Child as I shuffle and lay the cards out, okay? So we have a little bit of a vibe. <laughs> All right, so before we get into that, let's do this. This is Charmy time. So guys, this gets really loud. If you're sensitive to noise, you may want to lower the volume now. All right, ready, set, go. So, okay. All right, let's put this over here. Okay, and let's get some initials. All right, and 
before we do charmies let's do story time with my story dice guys if you want your own story dice they are available on my shop today all right so go ahead and check that out spirit talk to me what does possibly just want to see what i do right now all right so i see that things may be feeling like they're just like falling apart crashing in your person's world i do see that they're also feeling a bit sick so this could be that they're feeling down and out low vibrations due to their energy or that they have a cold they're actually sick all right but they have some healing to do for sure um they just recently went through an epiphany all right so they had some sort of wake up call and i'm seeing that your person is thinking heavily about what they're going to do next now i also see your person thinking about a home so this could be your home or their home they want to come in and your person is being very very dramatic i see your person being very dramatic about the situation with you crying being extra and wanting to have some sort of new beginning with you okay so that's what's roaming through their mind they're very very dramatic okay <laughs> is what i saw and this was story time with jalissa bless all right so let's go into the charmies charmy time all right so i do need to organize the charmies so if you guys could give me a second i would appreciate that bless hello there how are you guys doing i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are okay if you're new to my family welcome how you doing i hope you are good i hope you are okay all right um if you like it here which i hope you do consider staying okay all you have to do is subscribe and hit that bell button and you are a part of the family now not only do i post readings throughout the week and keep you guys updated with all different type of events in y'all lives but also i'm baby oprah so i gift everybody at least i try to all right that's the goal <laughs> every week i'm picking one random subscriber to bless i'm blessing one person with a spiritual box full of spiritual goodies this week i'm giving away my tarot deck a candle from my shop which i would choose intuitively for you and a crystal all right so if you want to be part of that join become part of the family babe what you waiting for winners are always announced on the community board monday tuesday or wednesday all right guys so good luck to you commenting commenting does help your chances in winning okay there goes a clue hi my ogs how you guys doing i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are okay all right guys so let's get into this um so what i'm seeing is that your person is manifesting a new beginning a new start okay and i see that your person is thinking a lot about money all right they feel like they're doing really bad financially and they're looking to either get a new job or um have some sort of lucky break financially all right now as far as initials go first middle last this could be yours or theirs we have t h s f v q h x e Q U R H G F X W L L L P M. Okay, now let's go into the charm. Spirit is saying to listen to your heart. Okay, listen to your heart when it comes to this matter. And I do see that someone may like to get intoxicated or high. All right, I see that your person is going to want to put all their eggs in your basket, okay? Meaning they're going to want to take, is either all or nothing with you, all right? They're going to want to take a chance. And I'm seeing wedding cake here, all right? So you may be invited to a wedding, or this could be your wedding cake, okay? But that is coming up. And we have three Destiny the Whales, all right? So there is a third party situation here. This could be friends, exes, family members, um, addictions. Something is becoming an obstacle in your connection or has been an obstacle, all right? I see that your person wants to create new beginnings with you, plant some new seeds with you, okay? Yes, I'm getting that your person would like to go for a walk with you, all right? kind of like one of those walks where you guys talk things out and express each other's feelings to each other all right and um possibly grab a bite to eat okay i'm seeing that this invitation may come in the morning time okay and i see that you guys are going to be blossoming especially when it comes to the way you speak the way you express yourself something about your voice um 
your words. I don't know if you guys are motivational speakers or influencers or you, you write or sing, but there's some sort of um, opening when it comes to your throat chakra and I see you guys blossoming, okay? A lot of mystery is going on right now, but things will become clear. You guys are magical, Patri. You have the siren, so your voice is very, very powerful and you should use that. Um, you're also very attractive and mysterious. People are very attracted to you. Spirit is saying to drink more water, okay, babe? You need more water in your life. And also, you're a master manifester. So remember, your thoughts are very powerful. What you think you will bring into your existence, your reality. So make sure that you are manifesting what you want. And like I said, there's a lot of mystery right now, but things are going to clear up. I'm getting um some sort of technician or mechanic here. All right. I do see repair in the relationship. We have the letter O. Okay. And Spirit is saying right now it is time for you to ground yourself and focus on your light. You are my sunshine, okay? So your person is letting you know that you are their sunshine, their only sunshine, and you make them happy whenever you're around. And we have basketball. So someone may play basketball or like to watch basketball. You are on your journey right now, Pau 3, and blessings are on the way. So Spirit wants to let you know that, wants me to let you know that. And um, live in the moment is your message right now. Live in the moment, all right? Don't live in the past. Don't live in the future. Live in the moment because that's what you got right now. Mm -hmm. And I see some money coming your way, which is beautiful, blessed. As far as signs go, we have Taurus. We have Sagittarius. We have Virgo. We have Taurus again. We have Capricorn. And we have air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, blessed. So that could be your sign, their sign, or within y'all chart. Okay, now we're going to do the question. So think of your question, babe, and I'm going to shake the globe and get an answer for you. And guys, let me know how you feel about the globe. Globe versus the pendulum. Which one do you guys like best? Your opinion matters, okay? All right. You thought about your question? Spirit, what's the answer for pile three? I want to shake it like I'm very intense. <laughs> I want to shake it a lot to make sure it goes around and around. All right, let's see what the answer is. Your answer is no. Past issue difficulty. Change your mindset. All right, and unhealthy negativity. That's what it says. Okay. Bless. So, guys, let me know what you feel about that. Okay. Okay. Now it is time for me to go to the extended, where we're going to extend this reading, and you could catch me there by clicking the link down below for the extended pile three. I'm going to go into your person. I'm going to get another channeled message from your person, see what else they want to say to you. I'm going to let you know what's going on and what's to be expected with your person and their intentions. I'm going to get a lot more messages from your person, and I'm going to get a ton, of, a ton, a ton of advice for you, Pal3, and that is going to be general advice, okay? I'm blessed. Like I said, link is down below. I hope to see you there. If so, give me a second. I will be right there. Pal3, if this is where we're parting ways, I just want to say I love you. Thank you so much for being here with me today. I hope that you enjoyed today's reading. If so, definitely give it a thumbs up. All right, if this resonated with you, give it a thumbs up. That helps the channel. It helps me. It lets me know you want to see more videos like so. Bless, thank you so much. For my new sisters and brothers, what's up? How you guys doing? All right, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell button. It's so important, all right, guys? And my OGs, you already know what time it is. I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in the next one. I'm sending you love, light, and everything nice. Mwah. Deuces. Bless.